So I'm going to be working on one of these word lock combination bike locks. Um, family member asked me to figure out the combination as they put in a new one, set it aside, and completely forgot it. They changed it from the original shed combination that's in the first step. One thing all bike lock combination locks suffer from is if you pull on them and put tension on the cylinders inside of there, um, more than likely there's going to be some sort of resistance because as you turn the dials, these cylinders rub against the locking key and give you a little bit of a feel for what's going on. So for the first round of cracking, I already know the code, but I'm just going to demonstrate exactly what I'm doing so we can work through it on another time. So the first thing you're going to want to do is put tension on this guy. And so for me, I have the lock separate from a bike or something like that, so I can go ahead and just use my foot to actually stretch out this band and put the necessary tension on it. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to rotate clockwise, so upward, till it meets the indicator. And what I'm trying to feel for is a very, very strong resistance. See, there it was. So L makes the clicking. See, it makes very loud popping. So the thing I found is if you work backwards counterclockwise, three digits, one, two, three. That's generally going to be your first letter. So now we'll go ahead and pull tension on it again and work on the next letter up. So the third letter. So I'm going to rotate it until there's a lot of resistance there. In this case, it's the letter K. So we'll move on to the second row. Once again, here's another digit that fights a lot, is the I. Now we'll go ahead and just rotate this one until we find it. Hey, look at that. How much you're having my brother set it to a random combination, which I will not know. Go ahead and mix it up first. Um, I asked him to make it not the letter E for the last letter, just so we know that the sticky trick on the last one works for different letters. Tension on it. Now we're gonna work through the dials right there. It's hard to see. Okay. Work clockwise. So why seem to crack? Try it again. Why is the sticky letter? So we'll move counterclockwise three. Last letter I believe to be T. So we're gonna work clockwise on the next set. Seems like S might be the letter. Move forward. A Let's try rotating through. Turns out the combination was fast, actually. If you found this video useful, please make sure to like it and comment below with your results. Let me know if you find anything else that works well with these.